Hello, and welcome back to Heist at Hilbert High Rise Hotel! Help is what I went hunting for, and holy... H word, I'm running out of H words. Holy hand grenade, I found it. Uh, well, I found some things I was missing. So, Chief of Staff Room, right? We were wondering how to get into the Chief of Staff Room. Have I been up there? I feel like I have. I feel like that here will get me in, but this also gets me the Chief of Staff Room, right? So. Hotel Administration, I can't get into yet. Chief of Staff Room, apparently I should be able to find an alternate way in to... Where's the Chief of Staff Room? Oh, I am a stupid fool. I am a stupid fool. Look at that. I've just been walking past this alternate way in for like 20 years now. Hello, I can just jump. Well, I can probably fuck it up. Oh, thank you. Uh, roll my eyes enormously. That was, okay, quite a lot easier than that. I was trying to make it feel. I just never happened to look across there. For some reason I thought this whole way just crossed the whole way. Assumptions. Sir Riemann, Chief of Staff, yeah. Riemann, what in the builder's stuff is going on down there? The entire alarm system is down. How can this be? It's too risky to operate at full capacity when our security system isn't functional. We'll have to discontinue our regular accom accommodations until the situation can be rectified. It goes without saying that this little hiccup is a costly ordeal for the hotel and must be taken care of post haste. Add it to Kevil's to-do list and ensure he completes all of his tasks tonight. I don't care if it's his night off. I count on you to be my go-between to keep everything running smoothly. If you aren't up to the job, we'll have to reevaluate our relationship. Trust me, you don't want that. Professor David Hilbert, PhD. Okay. Chief of Staff Key. Now that the Chief of Staff Key, let me get into the hotel administration. Let's hope it does. Let's hope I was just being blind and foolish and missing this very, a very, very, very obvious leap across the hallway. And also, this is the nook I was looking up at that before and thinking I, that I could have been there. Look at that. Chief of Staff Key. All right. Somebody is still alive and awake. Somebody with a sword. Somebody who needs to uh, be introduced to my Bonnie Bonce Bonker. That's the official name for the blackjack now, the Bonnie Bonce Bonker. What have we got here? Ah, it's all Greek to me. To whom it may concern, please refrain from opening the three windows along the upper corridor. The hinges are very rusty. If opened, they can get jammed into the open position and a great deal of force will be needed to shut them again. Accordingly, they are to remain locked at all times. We appreciate your compliance and apologize for any inconvenience. Sincerely, Hotel Management. Anyone found violating this directive will enjoy immediate and permanent unpaid leave or worse. Well, that's a hint I did not need because I solved that on my own. So, blah to you, hint. I'm smarter than you. Gallery management and curation. Customer relations. Wow, we've got a smorgasbord. Audit and tax. Of new rooms to visit. Legal and compliance. Human resources. Let's start with legal and compliance. Go oh, picking these with that guard going back and forth. Would not be the most entertaining. Light switch. First light switch I think I've seen in the mission. Okay. Loot and... What kind of operation are you running here? I could have died. City code requires that all windows above ground level be doubly reinforced. The level of negligence on display within your organization is absolutely unacceptable. I expect that the remainder of my stay will be fully comped. It really is the least you can do after all I've been through. I'll wait in the gallery for the curator's personal apology and an acceptance of the above terms. Anything less, and I shall be forced to resort to legal action. I trust that you understand just how incredibly important I am, and that you will see to it that these issues are resolved quickly and amicably. Until then, I shall withhold payment. Frederick Juniper Rothschild III. See, there's the Infinity Pool. Hmm, so one of these surely gives me access to it. What's this? 
Hey Eric, thanks for greenlighting my request to hook up the Menga exhibit to the elevator power supply. I really appreciate it. Seriously, every taffer who walks through there feels the need to touch it. I get that, get that it's cool to hold a big marble block with zero mass, but is it really too much to ask that our patrons show a little self-control? Hopefully the new setup will dissuade guests from getting overly curious. I know it's a lawsuit waiting to happen, but it's just a little zap. Hardly the most dangerous thing we have up there. Thanks again, CFT. Okay. Let's leave the lights on, why not? Uh, human resources doesn't open. Audit and tax, maybe does. Okay, so the elevator power supply, switching that off, will let us grab the mega sponge, but the mega sponge is in the gallery that we can't access, right? Without the elevators, surely. Okay, girdle, audit and tax. I think your uh, accounts may be incomplete. Hilbert's High Rose Hotel financial results for the period ending 12 31 20. Okay, not so exciting. What's this? 1001 jokes to make people believe you have a personality. That would be very useful for me. Um, but uh, okay, so I guess if you pick this lock first, what's a nice dark corner to hide in, I suppose? What's this one? Gallery management and curation. All right, here we go. Oh, what is all this? Different colored buttons. Five white, brown, green, purple, blue. Oh, hmm. Safe. CF Gauss, gallery curator. Everyone's hiding money boxes under their desks. I guess maybe they use them as uh, footrests. That seems reasonable. A list of five numbers. 26. 8, 12, 4. 26, 8, 12, 4. Clearly that relates to this combination, but how do the numbers match the colors? I don't know. I'll Maybe the gallery holds a clue. And I can turn the lights on here too. Hey Carl, thought you should know that litigious little taff Lord Rothschild is threatening legal action against us based on what happened at his banquet. He gets drunk and breaks a window, and he thinks we're the ones at fault. He's got some nerve, I'll give him that. We'll certainly be dropping him from our special in event invite list from now on. Anyway, he's up in the gallery now, awaiting your personal apology. Don't worry, no one's telling you that you have to do it. I'm just keeping you in the loop. Eric A. Jaffield Esquire, General Counsel, Hilbert's High Rise Hotel. Hello, Carl. Sorry to bother you, but I'm trying to complete my quarterly audit of all hotel assets, and I've encountered a couple issues, both related to last night's Rothschild fiasco and the ensuing exhibit closure and asset relocation. After the incident, all five of the platonic crystals were to be placed in storage in the room with the Aphrodite statue. Is this correct? Records only show four of the five having been re relocated. There is no indication that the dodecahedral diamond ever left the exhibit room. Compounding the issue, no one has been able to locate the key to the storage room so auditing its contents is not feasible. Please see me at your earliest convenience so that we may settle these matters. Kurt Gödel, CPA, Audit and Tax Division. Right, the storage room. I've been in the storage room. I've looted everything there. The, the bonus objective ticking off is then not a bug. I just stole them from there without really noticing. Maybe they were in the chests? I don't know, but I guess I got them and I didn't notice that I had them. Customer relations. All right, this is a problem. I was counting on this getting me access to the infinity pool, right? I mean, it lets me see it. Surely I can get access to it. How else am I going to get that ring near the waterfall? Maybe I can't. And what, what is it that I'm seeing there on the wall? Maybe just lights. Maybe, maybe I just can't get there, but uh, there was a lever and everything. And another door, but the door is on the floor below this, or two floors below this. None of these windows open though. They all look out over the pool. You know, get nice views from these offices, they're not bad. Um, but, uh, alright, so, no idea what's in here, but I, if I go back to the gallery. So I have two, two hints now. Elevator power. Let's go turn off the elevator power, shall we? Elevator power disables the zap. So we can disable the zap. Um, this way. 
I can disable the zap. Maybe the emergency power will reset. I don't know how it's supposed to work. Oh, that's the pub. Don't understand what the emergency power thingy buttons are for. But I can disable the elevator power. And that'll disable the zap on the um, Mingo Sponge. It would have been kind of funny if I had to use the Mingo Sponge to collect water rather than the ordinary sponge, but you know. On the other hand, maybe the Mingo Sponge weighs about the same as the Aleph Stone? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Remember that book? Remember that book about the, uh, telling me about the Aleph Stone? I just got turned about by accident. I don't remember what it told me about it. Um, God, I can't remember what I was saying now. I was just, like, losing track of too many threads. I want to go to the gallery. I want to go find that book about the artifacts. This gets me to the gallery. Let's worry about the book later. The book is in... The, uh... Hello? What? How come the lift doesn't... Oh, I turned the... How come the lift doesn't work? He says, How come? Because I turned it off. Well, going up the stairs isn't going to get me up to the top. How come the lift doesn't work? Wasn't there an emergency uh, power reset around here? But it's no good, right? Unless pushing the emergency power thingy me wasn't the one in the staff area, security room or something, or on the way to the security room, wasn't in the security room. Yeah, I've been in there, I've done everything there. I don't know, what am I saying? What am I saying? What? Why, why is my brain not working? Because it never does. Um, things to do. Things to do. Let's, let's make notes. Right, let's make notes. I've got all those. They were in the storage room. I dealt with that code. I don't need it anymore. Okay. So. Manga sponge. Maybe same weight as Aleph. Check book. Then book in penthouse. Um, if it's the same weight, I can swap it for it, right? And that's what I need to do, right? How does power? How does elevator power and research work? Can I just push reset and grab mango sponge? Question mark. Okay, it's nothing to try. Another one thing I'm curious about is, can I access roof inside paintings? If so, does it get me in here? Probably not, right? And then that reminded me, there is also, there is another painting in Brewer's office that I haven't checked out. All right, what am I doing here? I'm looking for a power reset switch. <laughs> the only guard left standing. Um, let's not look for a power reset switch here, right? What's it gonna do for me? Nothing useful. Let's go turn the power back on. Still, I don't understand why I can... Oh, oh, I've just answered my own question. I just answered my own question. Right. I will not tell you the answer, you will just have to see how much of a stupid genius I am. Stupid because it took me so long to realise. Genius because, well, you'll see. Let's go turn the power back on. Uh, not that way. I mean, because what fool would ever want to turn the power off, right? Why would you want to turn the power to the elevators off when you need to get up the elevators? Obviously you need to get up the elevators. It's perfectly stupidly obvious. But, um... I feel like if I'd only been drinking more cocoa, I would have come up with this answer much sooner. Power on to the elevators. I'm going to need to go up the elevator. I need the power on. That's perfectly obvious. But drink more cocoa. Drink more Dutch cocoa, like 
Brewer is a Dutch sounding name, right? That that guy's name sounds Dutch, spelt in a kind of Dutch fashion. Um, <laughs> right to the lifts. Let us go to Brewer's office. I don't know what the power resets for, except to turn the power back on from up above. Which is fine, that's what I will need to do. I won't need to turn it off. We will need to turn it off to get the Menga Sponge, obviously. But we can do that. We can do that. We don't need you yet. It all begins to make sense. I'm not sure about sense. It all begins to come together. None of this makes sense. Speaking of Dutch, I feel like Escher must have had a hand in some of this planning. Yeah. Okay, with Brewer's office, I need Brewer's office, Brewer's office. See? That's not Brewer's office, that's the upper level. This is Brewer's office. As I mistakenly thought it was the library, and it still worked for the code I needed because it's squarish. Yeah, it kind of worked. Remember this painting? This is. You know, there's a note about paintings within paintings. This is why those paintings within paintings don't work. Because if I go in this painting, there'll be another painting within it and another painting within that. Before I do, I wanted to check out, I think it was this book? Yes, the Compendium du Magraphen Epistemology. Um, Hello, Stone, right? It's dark. Um... It doesn't say anything about the mass of the Yellow Stone. Right, that's fine. But I think the Manga Sponge might help me. But we have a painting I have not visited. So let's visit it. Oh, we haven't moved. But I've been wearing your spectacles, so I can't go back in. I'm inside the painting. What does that mean? But nothing's changed, I'm still here. But I'm inside the painting, but but I'm still here. But I'm inside the painting, wow. How can you be inside a painting but not inside the painting at the same time? And how does that help you steal things? This is why my genius plan, well, it should've been obvious. And also that painting is why I should've been drinking more cocoa, right? I would've thought about that painting more and not forgotten it for as long as I did. Hop, skip and jump with joy. Of course the elevator power is still on so we can use the elevator, right? No problem using the elevator. Let us go back down. Yeah, we're done with the upper floors. Who needs the upper floors? Who needs these lifts anymore? We can just go turn the power off to the lifts and be done with them. Who cares? It's ridiculous to, to worry about these lifts. Nobody needs them. Let's turn them off and never turn them back on again. Yeah, we'll just go turn them off. Forget this whole Alistair, forget this whole gallery, forget this whole upstairs. Who needs it? It's all just a waste of time. Let's just switch the power to the lifts off. Laugh at the lifts as they cannot move. Feel superior to the lifts. And take off our peril sensitive sunglasses. Look at this. Here we are. Back. Back at the top. Back at the penthouse. Without a lift. Actually. Oh uh, no, the bottom here is the library, it's the bottom of the other stairs I need. The bottom of the other stairs connects to the gallery. I know previously I was kind of confused about how the gallery connected to this area. And so I was going all the way down the lift and back up the other lift. But the bottom of the stairs here connects. So, let's just do a save because I haven't done one in a while. So we should get to the gallery through here. 
Well, not here. Further down. There's a few guards there kind of in the way. That's kind of annoying. But... But... Which part of the gallery was it? I forget. But we can go to all parts of the gallery. Oh, this is the stairs down. Which are actually nice gentle stairs so I can run down them without clattering. Oh yeah, look at all these guards, huh? Look at these guards. I've kind of forgotten where the Mingus Band was, but I know I remember. I'm in the wrong part. But I want to be in this part for a specific reason just now. Well, not a very good reason, but it is specific. Right? Those two things don't have to be the same. Oh, that's the guard up there I heard. Come on, guys, walk faster. I need to be there with you back to this room. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, go. Just the wind. Okay. Calm down. There's nothing there. You see Is someone there? there? So, lift power is out. Right? It's just in case there was any doubt. Now, that's inconvenient inconveniencing myself because uh, I can get back. I can get back the easy way. Let's get back through through here and off its balcony and I don't have to worry about wait for those guards again. So here we are on the upper floors, the lift power is out. Now we know where there's an emergency reset, right? Because it would be terrible to be stuck infinity floors above the ground. Um with the power of the lifts out. It would take you forever to go down the stairs to get back down. Like I would hate you have to have to evacuate this place in case of fire, but uh I don't think that's likely, at least not today. So, back upstairs. Right, so this part of the gallery is entirely unnecessary. Maybe necessary later for the whole colours, numbers thing. So this way is the gallery where the Mingus Punch was, and I believe I knocked everyone out here. But it's the elevator power Oh hey, before I go, can I clean up this mess? I guess this is supposed to be written in blood, it's just like so bright. Not you. Just so brightly written, you know, glows is kinda odd. Um, that it doesn't really convey that impression very well. So the elevator power is what powers this electric shock. Let's read this thing. It has infinite surface area and zero mass. Oh. oh no, it's just loot. Well, it's pretty nice loot. But, uh, and a bonus, steal the Manga Sponge. Bonus objective, but it doesn't help me get the Aleph Stone. <laughs> oh, what do I do now? I thought that would help me get the Aleph Stone. I thought it was being clever. Right, maybe the safe in the Chief of Staff. Was it the Chief of Staff? No, the Curator's safe. Maybe the Curator's safe has something to do with it. Um, we have this... Let's just come in here for a second. Five numbers. 20, 6, 8, 12, 4. Where have we seen numbers? Almost nowhere, right? 20, 6, 8, 12, 4. Uh, these pictures don't have numbers associated with them. Wait, I just remember there was a way through here that didn't seem to lead to anywhere immediately useful. I think 
it's redundant, but I should just double check, right? Should just double check. What I'm thinking is, maybe the paintings in the main gallery, in the main part of the gallery, have um, numbers associated with them and the colors of the paintings relates. Maybe this is perhaps far-fetched. Oh no, okay, this is just above where I came in. Oh, and I can't get down there very easily, right, but I can get up here. Or not. Surely you can mantle that carrot. Surely you can mantle that. I mean, I don't need to. This is kind of really... Yeah. You sort of can sometimes. It's little... Fortunately, there's an object on top of a brush and they don't line up quite. So if you hit the brush first, it'll be a little too far out from the object to mantle. Things like that. So the main gallery. Downstairs. Let's wait till their back's turned. Uh, are these actually windows you can climb out? Doesn't really matter. Because there's a door at the bottom here that gets you out there. Alright, so... Does, uh... Let's just tidy these guys up. Take advantage of the, uh, take advantage of the, what am I saying? The timing that it happened. Let's just do the same for these so I can have a look at all the paintings. If my theory, I mean my theory is probably wrong, but if my theory is right, I will need be easier with these guys out of the way. You see that too? No, you saw nothing. Frederick Juniper Rothschild, the third. You can sleep here too. Alright. Just gives me slightly freer rain. So like the theory, where's that, where's that, where's that list of numbers, right? 26, 8, 12, 4. Let's write that down. 26, 8, 12, 4. Then I can write something next to them if I, uh, if I see anything. Okay. I'm kind of just looking to see if any of the paintings have any kind of numbers associated with them. Probably not. Well, there's another painting within a painting. Pity I can't go to that one. Uh, these are just stock paintings. It's just not gonna. Stock paintings are never gonna be the clues. Uh, and other classical paintings that are also not gonna be clues. None of these are captions. So it's not like the captions can have any numbers in them. Ew. Um. So I think, well, we got to admire the art, right? It's not all bad, we got to admire the art. Um, and we got to knock out some more folks, which means it gives us free reign to the elevators here. We've got the Minga Sponge, so we can use the power reset, which I guess was this other power reset must have been here, right? One by each elevator so that you can turn the elevators on after having, yeah, after having disabled power. So now the elevator will work again. Right. We've got the Minga Sponge. It served no purpose to our ultimate goal. But got me somewhere. Now, how do I associate these colours? Don't need to come here. How do I associate these colours back to numbers? This is the gallery cur curator, right? Maybe I should knock those people out too, just to just to finish cleaning up. Right, I mean, there's obviously colours associated with some of these paintings quite clearly, but no numbers. How do I associate numbers to colours? 20, 6, 8, 12, 4. They're all multiples of 2. Um... 
4 by 5, 4 times 5, so that's 2 times 3, 2 times 4, 2 times 6, 2 times 2. Um, well, that doesn't really tell me anything. Like, yeah, they've got. Oh, how do I get these as well? Oh, don't. You look around and find uh, where you can pick the locks. Oh, I can't pick locks. Can I use one of my keys? No, alright. So, so there's keys to the hammer and chisel. Let's make a note of that too. Need keys for hammer and chisel in gallery. Right, how does the elevator panel reset work? I figured that one out. I guess sponge is not the same way as Aleph, doesn't, but it was still useful. Can I access the roof inside the paintings? I don't know. There was another painting in Brewer's office, I've used that one. Slowly clearing up this. It was writing on that book, it's not a number, is it? No. Builder be praised, it says. Okay. Not very. Very, what's the word? Uh, I don't know what I was saying about the painting. Something. Something very important. Stay in the dark. I don't want the other guy seeing your body. Before I've had a chance to wallop him. All right. Um. Speaking of colours, like look, they've got colours on the front of their shirt: red, blue, yellow, purple. The whole shirt is purple. Purple was one of the colours on the scenes. This was brown. Um, so I get the feeling now, right, that chasing up these builders' hammer and chisel, chasing up this code for the safe, I get the feeling they're just going to be more bonus loot, more bonus objectives, more secrets. I don't feel like they're going to get me anything that I need. Can't just break it, right? Yeah, I invested in strong glass. It's terrible. So, what do I do? Admire these windows. Um, doesn't really solve any problems, but... Um, how do I get the Aleph Stone? How do I... How do I do anything? How do I even run what I'm trying to do? Well, I've got another thing I can investigate. It doesn't help. It's going to be redundant. Um, but if I go back to the, the guest part of the gallery and go inside the paintings, I can look at the roof. It's really not going to solve anything. I'm sure there's nothing up there. I'm sure if there is anything up there, that it's just going to be, you know, secrets. I don't need to go the dangerous way. I can just come out here now and knock these people out. If there is anything up there, it's just going to be extra, you know, just some secrets. Not anything I actually need. But there's no harm in checking, right? No harm at all. So. Come on, Garrett, you can jump better than that. Probably also save in case you fall to your death. Garrett, you did this before. Don't make it so hard. Why are you pretending it to be making it trying to make it so hard now? Why don't you mantle that anymore?
Well, maybe it's not metal though. I don't know. Let's try another one. As I said, this is absolutely guaranteed to be dead end as far as the main block goes. There's been nothing whatsoever to suggest that I need to do this. Although, interestingly, there's nothing whatsoever to suggest. Yeah, open the door, I don't use this specs on them. There's nothing whatsoever to suggest me going on that roof in the first place. Carrot. Jump when I tell you, don't run off the edge, jump. When I say jump, I don't just mean a little hop like that. Don't tell me you're hitting these icicles and get them out of the way. Yeah, we're gonna have to have a talk one of these days about your uh, like counselor trips to do the right thing. Can I get on this ledge? Can I jump from here? Is it? No, it's not gonna be high enough. Yeah, maybe I can't mantle it from here. I don't know. I don't know how I did it before either. From from uh, the ground floor, it seemed kind of fluky. That's why I'm a little confused as to how I'm actually supposed to get up there. Because it kind of felt like I was not doing what was intended. Anyway, uh, how do I escape the room with the yellow stone? Where do I find the keys for the hammer and chisel? Have I been? I think I've been in every locked room now. Uh, how do I get to the pool to get this ring? How do I solve that safe? Can I get access to the roof inside the paintings? It seems not. Why did I come the wrong way? Because I always do. Oh yeah, all the moss arrows are picked up here. I haven't had to use a single one. So I'm walking around with seven moss arrows. Uh, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. I, that's something I'm very thankful of in this mission. They're very, very sparing with the tile floor. They could have gone with the whole idea of, uh, you know, it's a really big fancy place, lots of tile floor everywhere. Nope. The only tile floor... It was a little bit, I can't even remember where it was, but it wasn't much at all. Uh, this way. What am I even doing right now? I am not pursuing any of my actual goals because I have no idea how to pursue my goals, so I'm doing something else. Which will not help me pursue my goals, but may help me answer a question of how would I normally get on if I wasn't mantling the statue, which again feels kind of like... I mean, I can do it, and for some reason that's much easier than it was in the past. But it doesn't feel like the intended way onto the roof, surely. Surely that's not intended. Low well, or why can I mantle it now and not when I go in the past for no particular reason? But over here, right? I can't get on the roof from this side at all. There's creepy gargoyles, but uh, there's also a big fence. But um, maybe I am supposed to mantle this. Maybe that is supposed to be the way up there. Alright. It's also very hard to do because this window is so thin so you barely get to jump. Or maybe there's supposed to be another way out here that I hadn't gone down to. Like I could come down from there, but that'd be kinda deadly. It's from up there that I've seen this window. Yeah, alright, maybe 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 mantling the statue is intended. And you just can't mantle the ones in the paintings. Because that would be silly. You can't climb statues in paintings, Garrett. That, that would just be ridiculous. Hey, do you have any advice for me, Mr. Spearman? No. Of course not. What about you, Mr. Other Spearman? You know what? It's time to go drown our sorrows. You know, maybe someone in the pub can give me a drink and help you forget all this trouble. Uh, a drink, please. Ten drinks, please. Seventy-five million drinks, please. I stole all these drinks, right? And... I mean, I don't even know why I'm doing this. There's not, not going to be anything up on these. Uh, what is the point of the pool cues? Why can 
they highlight. It's very weird. It's really not just a bug, unless there was a bug when I used the 8 ball, but it gave me money back because it's the last ball, and so I get the deposit back on the thing. What's that window out there? Oh, that's just the. That's just out here. So I am back to aimlessly wandering, which is really not a good look. Right? Really not a good look. So, what do I do? Stare at the ceiling and hope that illumination comes. I mean, literally, illumination is coming from the ceiling. That's not really the point. Uh, I am missing something big. I've got too many questions, not enough answers. None of these things were giving me clues. I kept this. Why did I keep this? Clean up the mess in the Alistair and I just brought up all access points. Right, so that one was a clue telling me how to get into the West Wing, but I found a different way in, so it was fine. Clean up the mess in the Alistair next ex exhibit. Well, that's fine. I don't think that one's a clue to anything. There's a mess there. He needs to clean it up. I don't know who I actually died there. Oh, it was Brewer that died there, wasn't it? Um, but yeah. Oh, got killed there by, uh, what's his face? So I don't think I need to note to Kevin. I can get rid of that. List of five numbers. List of five numbers. I don't know. I can sit and watch the pretty manga sponge spin round and round and round and round. Or I can go hit the forums, which is what I'm going to do. So, nothing matters. Everything's fake. We might as well be in a painting, staring at a picture of ourselves, staring back at a picture of ourselves. Guess what? I thought I was so clever. I should have drunk more cocoa. You know the problem with the getting the Minga sponge. Here I was stuck in this upper floors thinking, well, to get the Minga sponge, I need to turn the power off. To turn the power off, I need to be on the basement. Oh, and to from the basement, if the power is off, I can't get back to the upper floors with the Minga sponges, right? There's a kind of catch 22 where, well, you're stuck in one place, but you need to be in another place. Well, you know that works, right? That's just just plain, simple logic. Nothing strange about it, right? Just to get to get out of a place you're stuck in, you just need to be in a different place first. If you're stuck in a painting and someone tries to trap you in the real world, you just exit the painting, right? That's exactly how it works, right? As every as every cocoa drinker knows. All we've got to do is be stuck in another painting again. I... Here's the funny thing. With the e all the extra elevator power bits, there seems to be more clues hinting towards it as, as a solution for the Menga Sponge than as a solution for the Alastone. Now I'm in a painting. The Alastone... We access from... Yeah. Doesn't matter if we get stuck. Just don't look at it. It's too long. Oh no! We're stuck! We can't get out! The way out's only sealed! But if we were in a painting, we could take off the sunglasses. Objective to complete. Find and steal the Aleph Stone. Alright. That was all it took. I had the solution. I knew the solution. I just didn't think of it. It was exactly the same solution as the puzzle already got. You know, that's good. I like that. I love that. But it's just... For some reason, the mechanics for that... Did not connect. Did not add up in my head to connect me with what I needed. 
Let's go in. So now we have the Ella Stone. Not the flash bomb. We can actually look at it here without getting mad. Wait, what? What? Oh, I thought we should have to get out of the back out of the front gate. I finished the mission. Make your way into the temple. Oh, of course, because this I think this is setting up for a second mission. Um okay then, so some loot by the pool. Some other bits I didn't manage to figure out. A few secrets, didn't figure out the colours, numbers, safe code. You know, we didn't manage to get the builders hammer and chisel, you know. I I'm okay with that. Um Maybe I can come back and try it sometime later. Pick up where I left off and try and figure them out. I got the main mission done. I think I think that is good enough. Um, yeah, I don't need to be too bothered about loot. But we got what eight thousand something loot? How much is there in here? Ten thousand two hundred seventy. Wow. Four more secrets. Okay, so surely one of them is a safe. Probably one of them is getting into the infinity pool room. Uh, the others, who knows? I still feel pretty good about that. And uh, apart from, I guess, two hints. I solved all the puzzles. Two hints. One was getting in... <laughs> wasn't a puzzle. One was, how do I get into the room where I could just jump across in? Uh, that's just compensating for my blindness. Um, but the other one was just, how do I get the Alistair out? It's like, I wasn't thinking outside the box. Dun, dun, dun. Um, quite literally, I was thinking, here I am stuck inside this box, not how am I inside the box and outside the box at the same time. Which, of course, is the obvious solution, right? How do you how do you escape a locked room? Well, you just make sure you were never in it in the first place. While you were still in it. You know, you're in there, but you're not. It's, it's like as old as the hills. So, that was the heist at Hilbert's High Rise Hotel, which is like... Act one of the Triptych of Infinity. So, sometime this this was only just released uh, a few days ago. This mission. So, sometime in the future, uh, we shall be seeing sequels to this with more musings on infinity as we enter Cantor's Paradise and whatnot. All right. Uh, thanks very much for watching, and I hope you'll join me next time, soon, hopefully, for the next mission. But uh, bye for now, to steal a phrase.